Darren. 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 I know what it is. It's what? Vertigo. We're going to get you sorted out today. We're going to get that head sorted out. What's all this? This little setup. Yeah. Little... There's some toys. Is that your advent calendar chocolate? Yeah. Hold Mummy's hand. Can you believe this? Whoa. He's been really brave, hasn't he? What are you doing here, Dad? Uh, I'm trying to put some tea tree oil inside my ears. Smile. Was it worth it? Having those nice, perfectly straight teeth? Well, it depends how long this lasts for. <laughs> Tension in the jaw, it can lead to inflammation in the ears, damage the nerve endings, and then basically cause something like vertigo. I mean, because we've been so busy moving and focusing on that, and then the daily vlogs as well, literally this vertigo thing down was just sort of like, Putting up with it. To ignore it. The feeling's like the ground going out beneath me and a bit of sort of double vision all the time. Everything's really glary. But it's now been like about four weeks. Would you like I just to can't not... see properly and I feel like I'm in another dimension. I, think what's like, a I just want to like... feel like I want to be present. You've just been putting up of literally feeling so dizzy and I just can't even comprehend what you've been going through. Come on, we can do this. Yep. You're a little smart now. Yeah. Smell smelling of tea tree. How does it feel yeah. coming outside? and that massive drop. When you put sunglasses on, you don't get quite so much of that double vision. So. You started wanting to wear sunglasses indoors and everything, but I was yeah. like, oh, you can't do that now with the daily vlogs, because basically people are going to think you're trying to be Casey Neistat. Yeah. Guys, get some exercise. That's the worst in natural health store then. 1.5 kilometer walk. I'm talking about my double vision there. I know. <laughs> Your hair looks nice today. It's not that way, Darren. Over there. Actually, I think it is that way. The Barbican, doesn't it? City London. Can you remember the Barbican, Sienna? Can you remember the Barbican Library in London? Sienna? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, careful. Oh, I thought you were going off the edge. No. No, I'm the one without a go. <laughs> What's happened there? Oh, I can see yeah. it. It's got a little green, um, ah, in the middle oh, of what's yeah. that called? So what are we going to be trying to find in here then, Darren? Uh, some of those ear candles. Worth a try, yeah. isn't it? So you don't have to feel like this yeah, all the time. Yeah, we got colonics when we first went vegan. Shh, don't tell people that. <laughs> so here we are. Uh, they are dead. Ah, I think that's exactly lighted, what you need, yeah. isn't it? That's going to be you soon, Darren. Ciao. Ciao. Yay. I'm looking forward to doing that later, yeah, to yeah. you. I'm going to set your that head on really fire. Easy. Where are we now going? The vegan cafe? The free Wi Fi. Yeah. Free Wi Fi. Wi Fi. Wi Fi. And to what? have a nice little bit. Oh. My bra to my bag. There you go. Ah, thank you. What are those pigeons doing? You know? Ah, look, six minutes. Yep. Yeah, cool. let's go. I think that's the post office over there. So you're going to get to experience your first Spanish post office. <laughs> Oh, what? Did that lady give that to you? Yeah. That's the Patreon rewards sent out. Thanks, Jules. Every day is beautiful. Mm. Yeah. As so. if this is their winter. It's like literally our summer. You'll notice how I stand when I go near things like this, though. Oh yeah. Because I feel so unsteady. Here it is. Oh, close. Is that? Oh. Yeah. Monday, Tuesday, closed. So, Dos Mango, Finlete, uh, um, Dos Cafe. It might not be a vegan place, but at least there's Wi Fi and soy milk. We're going to do a little bit of work, aren't we? What are you going to be doing? Uh, we're going to try and use the Khan Academy app. Don't know how that is. You're reading that. I'm going to do a thumbnail. Dad's uploading the video. Why are we Yay! Nice. Oh, Dad, that looks lovely. I love a frothy cappuccino. Finished. Start massaging your temples and massaging your head and make it like a spa. Sounds really <laughs> fun. I feel like I'm a little kid. You know when you like set up something in your room, like you pretend you have got a little library. You needed that, didn't you? Yeah. Shake all your head. But do your dizzy and vertigo-y. Well, that's a good run. That's good. Okay, that'll do. Yeah, Come thanks, on. Darren. Is, that, is it make it even more like, harder for you when you're practicing to have vertigo or trying to look like you're 
Well, I just have to have my feet like that so that we feel sturdy. What have you found there? Some nice rye bread. Mm. I might wouldn't mind getting that to some avocado and taste. Um, sauce. Bread. And who are they? That's it. They're nice when they ripen to go in the drop here. We need yeah. to get some oats. I think they might be a bit animal. So happy. Put it right in my face. It's a lot of rolls, isn't it? Will we use that by the time the end of the month? I don't know. Neither we. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Bread smells amazing. You're recording, Mum. That's not a wiggle. Dinner time now? Yes. Home sweet home, and you can go to the toilet. Oh, this looks amazing. There's our big salad and our big like lentils, beans, and greens meal. Dad, it's ready. Get to enjoy one of our home comforts for a dessert: berry cereal. Sienna was just saying if she had a baby, she could only have one because she's only got one name, which is Lily. And then she's asking if we could choose whether it's a boy or a girl. And then Mia said her favourite names for boys were Jamie. And Oliver. <laughs> this is what happens after the frozen berries. The aftermath. <laughs> Not as bad as banana ice cream though, can you remember those days? Go and settle down. And I'm gonna sneeze. Okay. <coughs> Bless you. Excuse me. You come and lay down in the spa, okay? Yeah. I'm gonna put some relaxing whale music on. <laughs> 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 um, if you're going to set light to it, I just think I shouldn't be on a massive flammable blanket. I'm going to show you how to use the Hokie Gig Act. We do feel like I'm doing a good experiment here. I'll burn that. Really? That's what they look like. No? The man has got his head laying down on that, on the pillow. Look at his face. He's like... He's having a right Look at him. Time. He's doing it himself. He's having a party. Have you just not noticed he's doing it himself? Poke a hole through your paper plate. Tape it side down, place tape it side into the ear, keeping the candle in a vertical position. <sighs> Should I get the camera set up here? Because I don't really want to vlog with one hand while I'm doing this. I feel like I'm in some sort of hospital situation. What way does that actually burn them? Does it have a flame on it or do you blow it yeah, out? It's a flame, you don't blow it out. It's not right. This is not right. I promise. Look. Why is there massive flames? I can see them in the corner of my eye. Look at all that steam coming out, guy. Girls, come and have a look. Look at that. Can you concentrate, please? <laughs> I know, seriously, <laughs> this is terrifying. Please calm down. Do you want to take a little go at fogging it? What's going on with Dad? If it didn't have those massive flames on it, it'd what be you, fine. Just calm down, because that'll make the candle yeah, more calm. if you calmer. hold it nice and still then. Cause you, because you keep swinging around and like swinging through the grapevines I'm and I'm perfectly that. still. When swinging, you watch swinging through Darren, the trees. you can't tell me to stop swinging because you've got a vertigo. Can you feel it yeah. snug in there? Yeah, I can feel it snug in there. How do you put it on fire? I'm really scared about you. What do you think about Dad? Uh, <laughs> right, put that down and we'll do the other one now. Do you think it's better if I hold it this time? You get to do fun things. Because of Dad's um, vertigo, we're getting to do this. <laughs> you get to try out putting oh, a flamethrower inside a human being. I it's it a in. massive one, look! Is that it? Yeah. It really smokes to begin with. I hope there's no smoke alarm in here. What's that little bit? I'm not, the I'm blue flame, that's very high. No, no, the heat. bit, the bit that's... There's a lot of crackling and stuff going on in this here. This one seems to be lasting longer, doesn't it? Yeah. A couple of weeks. Boy, uh, what can Dad Get on fire already. There we go. I feel, like, I feel like a new man. <laughs> Do you feel dizzy? Can you feel a change? It hasn't done anything, no. But I wasn't expecting it to suddenly magically do anything anyway. No. The brace tightening and causing all the nerve endings to it get is, damaged. It tied him. But I said well, to I've, Darren, I've if managed, he's managed... Yeah, sorry. I've managed to pretty much keep it to myself for about the last four, four odd weeks. Yeah. So I'm able to function. That's not a fire anymore. <laughs> I'm back to life since. So yeah. we'll see you tomorrow. Thank you for watching our video and if you haven't subscribed yet make sure you do because we're going to bring out vlogs every day. Showing all our funny times, our laughs. Just normal life. Normal normal, life. Really, yeah, normal. really appreciate your support. You're helping us grow so much and we'd really love it if you are enjoying the vlogs if you can share them on your social media like Facebook and see if we can get us to 100,000 subscribers all together. So bye! Bye! bye. Just you calm down, breathe. I've got like a petrol bomb on the side of my head. <laughs>